Amen. So can you first uh, tell us your name and where you're from? My name is Virginia Acuna, and I'm from California. And Virginia, can you tell us what was the problem that had brought you here to the prayer with the anointing water and the testimony that you have to share with us today? I had a surgery 13 months ago for a hernia, and it was through my navel. They put a mesh, and uh, it was like something plastic. I don't know, something foreign and... Um, it, I had pains in my belly, and I couldn't stick my belly button in, or I mean my stomach in, or stand for long periods of time. I was really miserable. So what exactly is a hernia, and how does that affect your body? A hernia is um, like a bulge um, in your like intestine, something like that sticks out, like comes out, um, or when you lift heavy stuff, and uh, so it was sticking out. So you said that 13 months ago you had a surgery and a piece of mesh was put in to hold in the part of your stomach that was coming out? Yes. And so can you um, please continue with your testimony and um, why you had come here last month to receive prayer? So I was miserable and I just thought, you know, um, maybe God could help and he did. <laughs> so, so really quickly, so after you had gotten that mesh put in there, you had said that it was causing you pain. What kind of pain was it causing you? Um, stomach pain. I couldn't stick my stomach in. It hurted in the navel area. And what kind of things were you not able to do because of the pain that you were having after you had that surgery? Because you had said you had the hernia and that after having the surgery, the pain actually increased. Um, right. I couldn't wash dishes. I couldn't clean my house, take care of my kids. Um, I was just in bed all the time. So you mean to say for 13 months you were laid up in bed the whole time? Yes. Wow. So when you came here last month to receive prayer with the anointing water, what happened to you? Um, came for prayer, and I got spray anointed and um, went home. And a week after I got home, I felt normal. Wow, let's put our hands together for Jesus. So you mean to say that one week after receiving the prayer with the anointing water that all of the pain ceased in your body? Yes. Wow, so what kind of things can you do now that you couldn't do before? I could jump, I could stick my stomach in, I could um, just stand all day. Can you show us a little bit about what, what you can do now? Straight, push it in, it doesn't hurt. Jump. <laughs> Amen. Let's put our hands together for the living Jesus. Wow, what a wonderful testimony of how God can truly heal us from pains that we're having, things that are foreign in our body, that he can perform a miracle and perform his own surgery in our bodies. Amen? Amen. So for Virginia, now you're here, and now that you've received this wonderful healing and you can move and you have life again in your body, what advice do you have for the people here today? Um, keep your faith, and God can heal. He works miracles, and he can... Heal anything, anything that's troubling you.